and George Bardis. Taking you by school weather and Caleb and Mama Sports. At this time, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Attention, salute, pledge. Today's weather is sunny with a high of 70 and low of 43. Fifth grade goes to Paris Mountain today. Beta Club induction is this morning at 9 a.m. Our GS3 sports teams are back in action tonight. Versus Greenfield Middle, Softball plays Blue Ridge. But point cards come out on Thursday. March 31st, 7 a.m. on the middle school track. Run Club Spring 2023 kicks off for those who register. Once again, it is sold out for the season. Sports anchor Caleb Bellow previews today's game against Greenville and Blue Ridge. Caleb. I'm here with Gabriel Molloy. And you guys have a game against Greenville tonight. What are some things you need to do in order to win? Play good defense and hit the ball good. What are some things your team needs to work on in order to win? Lift our players up. Thank what do you guys you. have to do in order to win tonight's game? Um, we probably have to work really well together. We have some problems with communication, but we're getting good at it. And I think just put a lot of pressure on the other team. What is your team really good at doing? We are really good at working together. We do really well with passing. And <coughs> we have one really good person who's really good at shooting, so it works out. Thank you. I'm here with Skylar. And what are some things you need to do in order to beat Blue Ridge tomorrow? Um, have good communication, have a positive attitude, yeah. What are some things your team needs to work on? Communication. All right, thank you. I'm here with Samuel. And what do you think your team needs to do to win? Uh, play intensity, y'all confidence, and pass around the ball. Thank you. Now it's time for the beat the Freightways. Let's check out our top tenants. Go, folks, what do you have for us? Okay, it's fine. Welcome to the Beat the Frailix segment where we talk about our March Madness and well our bracket is completely busted as most of y'all's. Uh, we chose Alabama, Marquette, Texas, and Gonzaga for the Final Four, none of which actually made it. Who would have known that not a single number one seed would make it to the Elite Eight, yet alone to the Final Four. The Final Four takes place this coming Saturday, April 1st, which seems kind of fitting based on everyone's busted brackets like it's an April Fool's joke. Florida Atlantic, a 9 seed, takes on 5 seed San Diego State at 6 p.m. Then 4 seed UConn takes on 5 seed Miami, immediately following at almost 9 p.m. So, the big question is, did any of you guys land? Did anyone have any, anything close to this? There are still 5 students in the running to win a prize for their bracket choices. All students picked just one of the final four teams. Ethan Tantrum picked Miami, Haley Burdett and Tyler Davis both had San Diego State in the Final Four, and Emma Fleener and Elijah Bachman chose UConn to make it in. Will any of these five have a team in the championship game? We'll update you again on Monday. And now for fun facts with Elaine Stamper and Star Belt in the field. Avocados are fruit, not a vegetable. Human teeth are the only part of the body that cannot heal themselves. Teeth are good in an animal, which is not a living tissue. The heart of a shrimp is located inside its head. They have an ocular, open circulatory system, which means they have no arteries and their organs flow directly in the blood. For today's Together Tuesday, we draw your attention to this quote. Talent wins games, but teamwork and intelligence wins championships. Michael Jordan. Thanks for watching the RGS News Show.